I'm so proud to be here today to honor the dedicated, uh, long-serving members of the Alberta Fire Service. There are not many people in the province that can truly say that they are in the life-saving business. And to stay in that business for decades is a mark of great courage and leadership. The milestones that we are recognizing here today are nothing short of remarkable. In any job, the level of commitment is to be commended. But when you add in the danger and the sacrifice that fire service personnel face every day, there is no question that we are honoring a very special group of individuals. I know many of you have traveled from smaller communities in the province of Alberta. And we know as a government that whenever you do receive a call, a first response, you really don't know when you get to the scene whether it will be a relative, a community member, someone that you know very well. So we appreciate not only the life-saving skills that you have, but we're also fully aware of the stress that comes of serving in that capacity in the communities in Alberta. So that is why it is so important to gather and celebrate service and taking the time to reflect on your career and achievements with co-workers and the people that you love is always time well spent. The posthumous awards that we are presenting today are a reminder that life is short and we need to hold onto those moments tight and never let one pass by. I know that the spirits of those and these recipients are looking down on us today. You are all family, brought together by your common duty to help others regardless of the risk or the reward. Every firefighter, in sacrificing their safety and well-being, gives their community a gift unlike every other. The gift of security and peace of mind the knowledge that no matter how big the flames or how dangerous the situation, there are a group of people out there that think nothing of those challenges. They think only of helping others. Please know that all Albertans are incredibly grateful for your dedication in keeping us safe. Congratulations to you all, and I hope that you enjoy this day with your colleagues, supporters, family, and friends to the fullest. Thank you so very, very much.